Um, and I wasn't directly affected by the floods. As it happens, I was working abroad on a cruise ship um, and I woke up on Boxing Day morning, looked at my phone and saw pictures of Hebden completely flooded and I was like, man, what's happened? Um, and I wasn't actually back in England until about February um, and when I came home it was a real shock to see how people still weren't back in their homes and businesses were still closed um, and I, I work in Hebden Bridge so I do, I do see it um, but I heard about the Watermark Fund and I thought oh that seems like a good idea um, and at the time I didn't have really any thoughts on how I could get involved um, but then I had an idea which doesn't happen very often um, and if I do have one it's not very often a good one um, but usually at Christmas time I like to make my own Christmas cards and I thought to myself well why don't I make some cards and sell them um, and, and have the money go to, to the watermark fund um, so I mean usually when I make my Christmas cards they would glitter and fluff and kind of rubbish, um, not really great for commercial sort of thing. Um, but I thought to myself, well there's loads of artists and designers and loads of talent in Hebden Bridge. Um, and so I contacted one of the local um, cartoon artists who used to work here in the town hall um, called Fran Orford. Um, and he like jumped at the chance um, as soon as I explained to him what I wanted to do, you know, to make some Christmas cards and stuff for the Watermark Fund. Um, and he donated free of charge um, some of his Christmas images. Um, um, and then I got into contact with um, Lambert Print and Design and sort of asked them for the prices of it because I don't have that much money. Um, and they really generously um, said that they would do the printing for free um, and so it meant that I was able to put together these festive cards um, like, and it didn't really cost me anything other than my time um, you know a little bit of organisation <laughs> um, and so here are my cards um, they cost £5 um, and the whole £5 goes to the watermark fund um, and I wouldn't be able to do that without the help of Fran and the guys at Lambert Print and Design.